guys, wanted to get you this quick video of Mr. Jet. He is being a little rock star this morning. He's doing super good. Um, so he's working with um, someone new today. This is Alexa. She's been helping me um, work dogs and she's learning to be a trainer. So what we're doing um, with Mr. Jet today is introducing some e-collar to this heel. So what our heel position is going to mean for him is going to be a very, very specific um, command for him. It's only going to mean you walk on the right hand side, on, on my right, in this nice heel position. Not in front, not behind. Good boy. Just like he's doing right here. So we don't want him too far ahead. We don't want him uh, too far behind. We don't want him sniffing the ground. We don't want him focused on anything else except us. Good boy. So what we do is uh, this crazy man walk that Alexis is doing. We just do lots of changes of direction. He loses focus because there's a couple dogs across the street over there. Kind of wanted to say hi to him or just wanted to say hi. Good. Good. Working through it. Good. Good boy. Well, I'm talking to him now. He's getting distracted. But when he kind of gets distracted, he, you know, he put his nose down to sniff. He wanted to see those dogs. Alexis changes, changes directions and goes away from him good heel and gives a little bit of guidance with the leash and a little bit of help with the e-collar as well um to make sure that he knows where that position is that he needs to be in good job buddy so um <clears throat> when when he's not in that little box right next to us healing that e-collar stimulation is coming on and we did a little bit before this too where we teach him hey when you feel this e-collar pressure it's the same thing as a leash correction so you have to follow us you have to come to us and so he knows that the e-collar correction is coming from us and he knows that it he knows how to turn it off he knows that he has to come back to us and listen to what we're asking and and give us focus and that makes it go away good boy Oh, I know. I said, I said, good job. <laughs> he's like, hi, I know you. <laughs> good job, Jet. So basically when he's in this little position next to us, that's his safe spot. Um, he gets a little reminder, a little correction if he's not and not right next to us. Good boy. Um, and he gets lots of praise and lots of communication. Good. There we go. Good job. That's some good handling right there by Alexis. We, were, we use a lot, of, a lot of body language to help him understand where to be as well. So that's why we do lots of Changes, changes of direction. We help with the leash if we need to. We will pat our leg and, you know, show him where we want him to be. Um, and there's that e-collar um, little stimulation too. I think he's working pretty low. What's he working on? Seven. Seven. That goes all the way up to a hundred. So I can't even feel a seven on my hand um, when uh, you guys felt that e-collar. So he's being really really sensitive to it which is good because we're, we can use it just at communicative levels it's not a correction it's not a punishment it's just hey little reminder tap on the shoulder you need to be right here with us and uh keep that really good focus that's a good boy mr jet so you see that tails up he's happy to be out but um we're working this focus exercise so that he really learns to stay nice and calm on our walks and really engaged with us so he's not pulling to say hi to people he's just worried about walking with whoever's holding that leash so anyway hope you're not missing your boy too much he is doing awesome and we're just laying a really good foundation with e-collar today